Hi everyone, welcome to another videos for MRCS exam. And this is the question and answer solve session. Question solve is one of the best way to uh, carry a better marks and pass the MRCS exam. So here are the question. First of all, read the question very carefully. Which of the following structures is not closely related to the posterior tibial, tibial artery? So it is one of the uh, short type question and the question volume here is very less so which of the following structure not closely not closely related to the posterior tibial artery so we have to first of all we have to find out the posterior tibial artery uh, location of the posterior tibial artery and the structure which lies close to the posterior tibial artery then it will be very easy for us to find out the uh, option which is not closely related to the posterior tibial artery here the options the options are soleus posteriorly tibial nerve laterally deep peroneal nerve laterally flexor hallucis longus posterior inferiorly and popliteus so we have to find out one of the options which is not related to the posterior tibial artery so first of all let's see the posterior tibial artery in the picture so here we can see this is the posterior tibial artery and uh, from here this is the lower part of the femur and here the tibia and fibula and we can see the popliteal artery from the popliteal fossa it divided into two parts that means the anterior tibial artery and the another one here we can see the posterior tibial artery and peroneal artery so the popliteal artery primarily divided into anterior tibial artery and tibio peroneal trunk followed by the tibio peroneal trunk divided into posterior tibial artery and popliteal artery and it lies the posterior part the posterior tibial artery it is lies the posterior compartment of the leg so the structure which lies in the posterior compartment of the leg that will closely related to the posterior tibial artery but the uh, other uh, sites such as the anterior compartment and lateral compartment they are not related to the posterior tibial artery so first of all we have to here uh, we have to know the structure which lies in the posterior tibial artery we know that there are a few muscles which lies in the posterior uh, part or posterior surface of the or posterior compartment of the leg and here we can see one of the options here, here the posterior tibial artery and a nerve going very close to here this is the tibial nerve so tibial nerve also related to the posterior tibial artery so we have to find out the structure which lies in the posterior compartment of the leg because posterior tibial artery it lies in the posterior compartment of the leg so here we can see the relation of the posterior tibial artery they are anterior and posterior anteriorly tibial is posterior flexor digitorum longus and posterior surface of the tibia and ankle joint so they are lies in the posterior compartment on the other hand posterior to the uh, posterior tibial artery they are the tibial nerve fascia overlying the deep muscle and proximal cover the gastrocnemius and soleus muscle and skin and fascia so skin fascia gastrocnemius soleus muscle fascia covering the deep fascia then tibial nerve then other structures such as the, the large muscle in the posterior compartment they are the tibialis posterior flexor digitorum longus and posterior surface of the tibia and ankle joint so they are lies in the posterior compartment of the leg on the other hand we can see this is the anterior compartment and here in the lateral part this is peroneal or lateral compartment so in anterior and lateral compartment there are the are the uh, several structures present here we can see the tibial artery which lies in the anterior compartment and deep fibular nerve or deep peroneal nerve it also lies the anterior compartment and some other muscles such as the extensor digitorum longus extensor pollicis longus and tibialis anterior is they lies in the anterior compartment so the anterior compartment muscle and anterior compartment contents such as deep fibular nerve or deep peroneal nerve and tibial artery they are not related to the posterior tibial artery on the other hand here we can see the superficial fibular nerve or superficial peroneal nerve they lies in the peroneal compartment and two other muscles such as uh, the peroneus longus and brevis they also lies in the peroneal compartment or lateral compartment so they are also not related to the posterior compartment so finally our final answer deep peroneal nerve because deep peroneal nerve it is the anterior compartment content so it is not closely related to the posterior tbl artery thank you all well.